Some of you know me as a specialty costume designer and foam fabricator, but I'm also a screenwriter and filmmaker. You may remember one script I wrote a while back. In the late 90s, Blue Rider Pictures bought a screenplay of mine called The Clown at Midnight. They had me do some rewrites on it and shot it up in Winnipeg, Manitoba. They hired some Canadian actors uh, to be in it, including Margot Kidder, whose work I was very familiar with. Many of you may know her as Lois Lane from the Christopher Reeve Superman films. The American producers flew me up to Canada to keep an eye on things, and I wound up directing second unit on some of the film. I remember the day I met Margot Kidder in wardrobe. She came in all boisterous and fun and said, well, I'm not Lois Lane anymore. Anyway, she was great. She had, uh, this was after her bipolar incident, which everybody liked to talk about, and no issues on the film whatsoever. The young cast uh, enjoyed working with her a lot, and she was a lot of fun. Uh, strangely enough, uh, her character dies getting an ax smashed in their face, which is interesting because that's uh, in a nightmare scene from uh, Amityville Horror, which was a pure coincidence since, of course, when I wrote this film, I had no idea who was going to be playing it. I ran into Margot several times over the years after that. She was always lovely, and when I learned she died the other day, it was very, very sad. She was a great actor and just a wonderful, sweet person. Rest in peace, Margot.